So my number one, whomever chose lap, lap is lazuli. What or whom you should be careful about. So meanwhile, go and subscribe. If you tell you not subscribe, if you tell you already subscribe, thank you for the subscription. Click the join button. Have a look at our YouTube store. Watch the ads. What or whom you should be careful about. What or whom you should be careful about file number one. Someone in your life who is not ready for the new beginning. This person may be single, independent, but you may be looking or you may be waiting that if at all this person say, okay, I'm ready to living in situation, ready for the living in situation, but they are not ready. They are not looking for any kind of living in situation. They may be enjoying their singlehood. At least, because I'm not seeing that this person is completely stuck kind of energy that they not don't not liking change. No, they're independent, single. They're like, see, I'm single, independent, I don't want anything. But, uh, and moreover, they are not ready for the passionate new beginnings. But you are like waiting for them to come into the union, which is like four of ones. <sighs> whom, for whom or for what, uh, what or whom you should be careful about. Or whom you should be careful about. You may be heartbroken about some marriage with someone who is like a jiggler, or I'm not seeing you are heartbroken. Maybe it is like. You may be dealing with two people, you may be already married to someone, but your partner may be a juggler or you want to juggle someone who is like a married person and who is like a living in situation. Because you are having two people, having, not wanting, you already have, you married to someone. But you are feeling like, Anita, I am completely with lot of burdens. I became like a machine. I don't care any feelings. I'm heartbroken because of this marriage, because of this juggling. Or your partner may be juggler. Take the message. So now you want to become juggler because if at all you go for some other uh, other living in situation, you will also become a juggler. You should be careful about this situation. More than person I'm seeing. You should be careful about situation, whatever you want to deal, because you want to deal with two people. One is living in situation, one is traditional marriage. So now you may be want to do juggling. Anita, I'm already married to someone in a traditional way. And I'm taking a lot of burdens on, the, on my shoulders because marriage, it is not this. Maybe you married to someone who don't know emotions. That is the reason why. Now, finally, you are feeling that lot of burdens on your shoulders, no emotions, nothing. And uh, you may be already heartbroken, which is like you may be blocked your heart chakra. But you cannot escape from that because it is like a traditional marriage. So now you want living in situation with someone. If at all this person comes, at least I will feel a little bit relief or this person is like my soulmate. Uh, this person understands me. But what you are not understanding is this person is not ready for the new beginnings. But still you want to juggle. Because here I am seeing your energy. You, you want to juggle. You need to love yourself. What you should be careful about. What you should be careful about. You are not healing. You have heartbreak, so you need to heal. You are not healing. And you are looking for some other opportunity to get into four of man's energy. You are feeling that, see, it will become more burdened, right? Because you already carry ten of hands. Again, you want one more hand. It is like, a, like you already married. You have a lot of burdens. Maybe that uh, partner is keeping a lot of burdens on you. So, what you can do is getting divorced. 
right? If at all you are feeling that marriage situation is not letting you to take a breath, sit with that person, try to solve the issue. If at all you feel that no Anita, this person won't change, they are treating me like a machine, then get out of that marriage because it is a traditional thing. Uh, you may be married traditionally, so you can approach legally and get divorce. But instead of doing that, you are like, no, I have someone who is single with that person I want living in. It will become more burden, don't you think? What you should be careful about. What you should be careful about. You need to work on yourself, listening to your intuition. You are escaping. Maybe you are uh, you are looking for the escape. You are looking for the approaches who is like an escapism, which is like escape. I want to escape from this instead of finding the solution from the for the problem. You are worried about the future, or at least you are worried what is going to happen. What is this now? You may be going through some anxiety. Because you don't care emotions, you are completely drained, close to your heart chakra. So you may be want at least some passion with this person, you may be not even getting. So you want to go towards someone who is single, so you want to have four of hearts with that person. What you should be careful about? You may be dealing with someone who is king of swords in the reverse. Abusive person. You may be have abusive partner. This person don't carry any kind of feminine side. Disordered, strong, disordered, abusive, feminine. Female, you may be got married. Who oh, you should be or what? I'm not seeing whom. Because you have two people. So this situation you should be careful about. Because you are juggling or you want to juggle. You want to juggle with multiple people. And this person is not ready for the four of wands new beginnings. And you got married to this feminine. Not feminine. This is not a this abusive feminine. And uh, maybe if at all you want to get divorced, this person not letting you to take divorce. Because this is a queen of swords in the reverse. They will abuse you. They won't even let other people to know how they are abusing you. And this is a closer minded person. They won't let you to... At least they won't understand other people's emotions, feelings. So they may be not letting you to take the divorce. And uh, you want new beginning with someone. Like living in situation with someone. So you should be careful about this two of pentacles. What you should be careful about? Or whom you should be careful about? This person took the control of you. Your life is completely under this person's control, I understood. But still, you see, what is this? It is a marriage. So, you, why you cannot take divorce? It is our, we are human beings. We have every right to choose whether we want to be in the connection or not. You are not listening to your intuition. That is the reason you are not finding the solution. What you should be careful about? Because of this person, maybe you are getting mental breakdowns. I can understand you are not living a happy married life. But this is not the solution, right? If at all you are not living a happy married life, having a second family is not a solution, right? <laughs> Instead of finding one thing, sit, find out how to find the solution for your first marriage. Instead of looking to set up a second house, because this is like a second home. 
you need to work on yourself to find out what is your wish fulfillment which is like at least what do you want and i don't want to tell wish fulfillment because you are not in that position you are like at least you you need to understand what you want when you are going to understand when you work on yourself when you are going to work on yourself when you drop the burdens why you are not dropping the burdens this woman not letting you to drop the burden your spouse not letting you to drop the burden why they are not letting you to drop the burden it is like uh, i used to have this uh, i think in the past somewhere i gave this deadlock situation i am seeing this deadlock situation here and then i want to work on myself i want to heal so that i can understand what i want at least i what i want so i i, I want on i can understand but whomever i married that person not letting me to heal until unless i won't heal i cannot decide what i want i hope you are understanding what you should be careful about but this is not the solution whatever you are feeling that going towards someone to have four of one that is not the solution moreover you have your own problems right you are bringing someone into that problem whomever that person as of now they are single abundant at least independent okay they are single independent happily living their life but you are bringing this person you are trying to bring this person into four of wands in your mess you want to bring this person in your mess you already in a mess you you know it or not and you are don't have any feelings that's why you are not realizing but you are in a complete mess you are it is not a marriage it is a mess you can take support of your family what you need to be careful about what you need to be careful about what you should be careful about maybe this is your past person whomever you are Uh, that person may be your true love now you realizing it in the past you may be in a depression some kind of uh, you are going through some kind of past memories depression that time you may be met this person got married now you came out of this past so now you are realizing that this person is actually true love and you carry lot of obsession towards that person <laughs> what you should be careful about in depression we should not get married you know we need to get treatment that's why i always say when you are in depression anxiety going through some kind of mental health issues we should take the support of counselor we should not go towards a partner what you should be careful about you want to make things right now because actually that person is my true love anita that time i am in depression so i married to this person and now this person not letting me to go anyway what you need what you should be careful about Maybe you are getting the justice, some kind of justice. You need to work on yourself. And you should be careful about. Maybe you are getting justice, okay? But you should be careful about this situation. Maybe you realize now what situation I am seeing is. See, I will tell you. take even if at all it is exactly matching with you okay you are going through some kind of depression you may be lost something living in the past or some sadness you don't know how to release the past sitting and crying that time you met someone and that time actually you don't even carry any emotions you are just living in the past you don't know how to release the past 
So living, see, sitting, crying, maybe having alcohol kind of things. Some kind of deep depression. Not dark depression. You met someone and you thought that maybe that time that person maybe either took advantage of you or you also maybe thought that okay, I'm sitting and crying, no one is there with me, so this person came, so nothing wrong to get married, so you got married to this person. No, no emotions, because that person also don't hold any emotions. There is no feminine that existed in that person's life, in this person, personality, energy. Now, finally you came out of the past. And you realizing that actually this person kept a lot of burdens on your shoulders. And you don't know how to escape from this marriage. Because this person completely took control of you. Maybe they even took the control of all your assets. If at all you have property assets. Because it is a traditional marriage. So in papers you declared that this person is your spouse. In your family everyone knows that this person is your spouse. So now you cannot es escape easily. But you can take support of legal system. Now you are realizing that there is someone who is single. That person is actually your true love. Because of your sadness, depression, you fail to see that. That person is your true love. Now you are obsessed towards that person. But you need to work on yourself. To take action towards that person. You want to make things right with that person. You may be seeing them like a pin of cups. What you, should, what you should be careful about. You are seeing the truth now. About your past. <laughs> you want to have a new beginning. At least a small new beginning. This person may be queen of pentacle. This person may be, at least you are seeing that that person is single. They are queen of pentacle, queen of cups. So you want to take action. You want to have a new beginning. What is this night of swords in the reverse? You maybe came to know about your person that that person is a criminal. Whomever you got married. That person is not a good person. So you don't even want to maintain friendship with that person. Now you are seeing the truth about your past person. Maybe that past person, maybe your soulmate or childhood friend, uh, you lost connection with that person. So that time you are sitting and crying, someone pop up in your life. So you got married. How you got married to someone just because in your depression without thinking who is right? More of a traditional marriage. And now this person is completely took the control. I am your wife. You cannot go anywhere. You should not do anything. Everything is under my control. Maybe as I said, they maybe took control of your assets, your properties, whatever it may be there. And now you want to go towards your love. Who is your... At least you feel that this person is my two of cups. You should be careful about this situation. I don't know how to solve the situation, but you should be very careful. Because you are dealing with Someone. What you should be careful about. You need to listen to your intuition here because you, uh, again you are if, if at all see, I will give you one suggestion. Okay, because here whatever you are doing, listen to your intuition is very important. Without listening to your intuition, don't take any action because it is a you are not, you may be, I don't know how you are watching, but it is a strong messy situation because whomever you got married, that is not a good person. That's right. It is like a criminal kind of person. So either they may be going to kill you or they may be going to kill other person, whomever you want to get married. And moreover, you married this married to this person in a traditional way. So they have all the rights, at least in your family, relatives, society, they may be know that this person is your spouse. So they hold the power. That is the reason control is in their hands. Don't take stand for this person, whomever that single person. First thing, why I will tell you. See, you are in a mess. 
just because you are in a mess to come out of that first to find the solution for your mess you need to come out of that mess then look for the love but you are still staying in the mess trying to bring someone trying to pull someone in that mess that woman or that person is single at least even though they won't get married they won't have a partner they are happily living their life but if you pull that person in four of wands living in situation you are pulling someone in the mess see this person energy is good wherever they are they are loving themselves they have their own money they have their own stability completely free if at all it is true love i can understand but you should see other person also moreover this person is not ready for the new beginnings with you or not for the four of wands because to this person is queen of cups they may be looking for the king of cups at least to this person is queen of pentacles so they looking for the king of pentacles here i am nowhere seeing that you are a king of cups or queen of king of pentacles or uh, you just to want to get rid of some kind of tension more than tension anita here i am not getting anything so i just to want to have some vacation kind of thing that is what it is that is what it is because you are not going to give name to this person that's for sure because your spouse is there already traditionally you know this person and you are bringing someone in that mess who have opportunities like this person can get anyone it is not that only you you are realizing that this person is true love so you want this person then i'm not telling miss you are true love if at all you really want your true love take stand for yourself but you are not doing that no one is i cannot take stand for myself then first what you need to do is drop this burdens how you are going to do it do as simple as tell that you got some illness so you cannot go for work for one month two months take a break okay you can do that some illness you cannot go anywhere sleep take a break completely then you can listen to your intuition because listening taking complete break no burdens no work nothing complete bed rest not dealing with anyone not talking to anyone then your energy whatever you lost because of this burdens okay you are you regain you regain your energy you will come into mm, okay you recharge yourself now slowly when you recharge yourself slowly you will connect with your intuition then your intuition is going to guide you how to deal with this situation instead of simply no anita i'm seeing the truth my past person is my true love i want to go towards that person don't what you should be careful about is this situation you should be careful you need to deal this situation with lot of care with by listening to your intuition i gave the suggestion if at all you feel that anita until unless i don't drop this burden i cannot listen to my intuition then tell any no problem if at all it is a lie also tell that you got some strong illness you cannot move from your bedroom sleep take a break that's it that's what you can do instead of doing that you are simply like no i want to go towards this person i want to tell them that i am uh, you are my true love so you come into the union if at all this person is true love you should come into king of cups so this person is queen of cups you both share two of cups which is like a traditional uh, which is like a spiritual union which should be in the traditional way which should happen in the traditional way you cannot pull one queen of cups divine feminine energy into this 3d things just you are thinking about yourself you are not thinking about the other person and moreover it is your mess you need to clear because you don't have any upper, uh, right to pull someone in that energy in this mess i hope you understand me what is the suggestion for you slow down and celebrate yourself i can understand you may be going through some kind of difficult situation you may be king of cups and this person may be like i'm the empress i don't want to give up on you you should be there with me you are my king of wands you cannot leave me you want to i want that anything 
I want that person. <laughs> It's a non-beast person. <laughs> I am ready for the sneaky link also. <laughs> uh, it comes with time and practice. Maybe you are feeling some kind of confidence issues, but this is not the right solution. Okay, because you are in problem. You know that. When we are in problem, we need to solve our problem. instead of doing that we should not pull someone in that problem and moreover that someone is very much free they have free will they are very much free and you want to bring that person in this mess that is the reason i am telling you need to heal okay may be going to some kind of poverty If at all you are going through some uh, poverty or some kind of abandonment issues, because this person is feeling that an empress, I open my heart to love and healing from the pleats. You need to heal. In here you cannot escape things from like this. In uh, until unless you won't heal, you cannot come out of this problem. Take it from me. If at all you think that no, Anita, I found some other solution. This is how I am going to solve this issue. No, it will become more mess. don't do that it will become more mess instead of doing all these things as a set take a break if at all you are not working for one month two months three months nothing is going to happen if at all you you feel that anita i am in the poverty no problem be in the poverty when you are not going out no one is going to see what what dress you are you wearing what clothes you are wearing right and no one is going to see what you are eating if you are just in the four walls you are just in the bedroom no one is going to see do that when we go out then only we need all those things that i want to wear a good clothes i want a car i want that i want this if you don't go anywhere when i realized it you no know, pandemic <laughs> we nearly used to spend 20 to 30000 just like that in our mall every month in pandemic we did not cross our credit card limit then we are we realize oh, oh if we go out then only we will spend the money if you won't go out we won't spend the money <laughs> so if at all you are feeling that it is a difficult time i mean fire fire of pentacle poverty as i said what you want money or healing now you are looking for the money no healing here to solve this issue you need healing not money understand the difference if at all you run behind the money this problem will become more complicated maybe you cannot come out of it moreover you are going to get some kind of image damage kind of thing because this see this person is very good in their place you are going to bring this person this person also get some kind of bad name for them by you or spouse maybe going to create that if this person became home breaker they broke your home by showing everyone that my family is a good family I have a great husband. I am the great wife because they came up like a empress. This person is not an empress. This is a disordered feminine, but they are showing up like I am the empress. So family, society, they feel that oh, this is a good wife. And if at all you go towards this person, other people think that you are the wrong person. You see, this person is an empress, very good wife. You are lucky to get this person, but yet you went towards some other woman. They are not seeing that you are in this position. you became a machine people don't see that so this is not the right way to deal with the things you should be careful about the situation instead of running behind this money take a break as i said take a break heal first and when i say healing here i am not saying that you need healer no just taking a break not carrying any kind of burdens on your shoulders if at all this person no one that they will mm, and putting the burdens tell some lie that you are you cannot work you need to take a break completely because of so and so illness that's how you can handle because when you take that break when you completely free you are going to listen to your intuition so you see that is the reason we should not enter into the relationships when we are in depression sadness when you are in depression 
you got married to this person. Where is that queen of swords in the reverse? Okay. When you are in a depression, you got married to this person. Now, you are in anxiety. Now, you want to get married with this person. So, it is you need solution, not escaping. In the past, you are in a depression. You need solution for your depression. That is nothing but meeting one therapist, counselor, so that they can help you to come out of your past. How to release the past, how to come out of your victim mindset, everything. So, if you took the support of therapist, you don't need to marry this kind of idiots. But you got married to this person because of your depression. Now, again, you want to do the same mistake. Anita, I'm in anxiety. So, now I want to get into the connection with this person. So, you are finding the escape. It's like you are, instead of finding the medicine solution, you are escaping, you are finding some kind of different ways to escape from those things. Actually, you are not going to escape. You will be more stuck in this situation. That is the reason. Take time. Okay, Take time. Take some break. Because you are like a king of wands. You may be a very strong husband figure, father figure, strong masculine. But because of whatever situation this person did to you, you lost all your confidence. You will meet this kind of idiots. These people don't even know how to treat a man. They treat men like a slave. So that you should work for me. Because you are... I am your spouse. I am like an empress. You should work for me. You are a slave to me. So, you will lose. They will beat on your con confidence. You will, They will kill your confidence every day, day by day, day by day, day by day. Self-esteem, self-worth, confidence, self-confidence, everything. You will lose everything. That's what happening to you now. But still, I am seeing you are strong. So, this is not the right way. That is the reason why you want to go towards the four of wands. But this is not the right way. You need to listen to your intuition. How? As I already gave suggestion, follow that. You should be careful about this situation, not about the people. This two of pentacles situation because you are juggling. It is very important. Okay. Thank you for watching. So, pile number two, whomever choose, Karnalin. What or whom you should be careful about. Okay. So, meanwhile, go and subscribe. If at all you not subscribe, if at all you already subscribe. Thank you for the subscription. Click <laughs> the join button. Have a look at our YouTube store. Watch that. So, what or whom you should be careful about? What or whom you should be careful about? What or whom you should be careful about? What? I think you, you have someone in your life who is like a who is going through some kind of anxiety and uh, you need to listen to your intuition because you are like no I don't want to give up on that person they are already going through anxiety and you are like no Anita I don't want to give up on this person you need to listen to your intuition they are also not listening to your in their intuition you are also not listening to your intuition you both need to listen to your intuition but uh, you are watching the reading because whom you should be careful about, you should be careful about nine of swords. Who is going through some kind of mental breakdown? Because of you, even though you get triggered, because you are creating mental breakdown for this person. Maybe they cannot handle whatever you are putting on their brain. Whatever mental tension you are giving to them, maybe they are not ready to handle that. But you are not understanding that you are stubborn way you are putting lot. You are giving a lot of mental tension to this person. They cannot handle it. You need to listen to your intuition instead of behaving in this stubborn way. Because stubbornness coming from you. What or whom you should be careful about? You maybe have options. Lovers, King of Cups. 
you maybe have options. You have someone else who is like a king of cups. You have this person who is going through mental breakdown, who is very calm, very patient, very loving, very caring. But you are like, no, Anis, I don't want this king of cups. I just want you a lot of attention to this person. Instead of listening to your intuition. Your intuition may be guiding you, but you are not. I'm not saying you're completely denying the intuition, but you are stubborn. You may be going through fire of pentacle. That is the reason you are stubborn. I want money. I don't want love. I want this victory. You are clingy towards this victory. You need to listen to your intuition. Again, I'm telling you. Because you are giving mental tension to someone who they cannot handle. You are, if this person cannot handle whatever you are giving to them. And you are not understanding that. Because you are a codependent or you may be very clingy. And you are feeling that if at all I leave this person, I will end up in the poverty. I will end up on the street. So no matter what happens, I am not going to give up. But whatever mental tension you are giving, they cannot take it. I hope you are understanding. You have option. King of Cups is there. You are not completely... On the street, if at all you really are on the street also, king of cups is there someone in your life who can take care of you. At least if at all you feel that, Anita, I don't have shelter. So I need to give attention to this person to get the shelter. Go towards the king of cups. They may be going to provide shelter. See, every problem no need to solve immediately. Take some time, take some break. Okay? You will get the solution. This is not the right way because you are mentally torturing someone who is not ready to take. See, everyone is not... When it comes to me, I can take a lot of mental stress. A lot. People will be scared of such kind of mental stress. But I don't. It is very natural to me. Sometimes even I feel that I am torturing my brain. But when it comes to physical, I can't. I will use only small, small things. I cannot lift heavy, heavy weights. My small sister, she's little. She will weight little. She will <laughs> lift weights. I even I wonder. Hey, you are like small, chota packet, bada the maka. Ah, but I cannot do that by looking. Uh, if people feel that she can handle weight, no, I cannot lift a lot of weights. I cannot take the burdens, but. Mentally, no matter how much pressure someone give, they cannot be to me mentally. Here, someone cannot handle the mental pressure. If at all you give a lot of physical, they can handle. I hope you are understanding. You need to listen to it. Because you are handling the things in a wrong way. If at all you put a lot of burdens on this person, this person can handle physical burdens. Like spend lot of money and tell them I want money. They will handle it. But don't give mental tension to this person. This person cannot handle mental pressure. That's what I, I that is the reason why I explained. But you are giving mental pressure to this person. Even though your intuition is telling don't do that. Because you have option. Don't do that. You have option. But you are not listening. I'm not seeing completely you are denying but you are like, no, I don't want to, stubborn, stubborn nature. No, I don't want to give up. But you are not understanding that person is not in ready for that, whatever you are giving. See, go within, go within. This person not trusting you. This energy is very strong. This person is not trusting you and you are feeling that I have emotions. This person is my ten of course family. We both are loving, caring couple. Do you really think that this is how you deal with the loving, caring person? If at all you really love your spouse, this is how you deal with your spouse. This is how you will give mental breakdowns. Give time to them. Take yourself time. Take time for yourself also. It is not that some... See, if at all you married also, we will get some ups and downs. Every couple will have that fights, right? When we fight, mostly my siblings will come to our home, parental home. When they fight with their husbands, they will come our home and they will complain. Like this, this is what they are telling. I will, I will listen both the sides. My mom, <laughs> whatever they are telling, they, she will listen and she will, like how you will tell that? I will know, don't trust these kids. <laughs> they will tell only their side of the story. 
I will call them. I will ask what happened exactly. They will tell entire story what happened because they won't lie. They are very honest. They will explain what happened. Then I will if at all these people, my sibling did something, I will scold them. This is what you said, but you did not told me that you said this. You talk like this. That is the reason why that your husband told. They won't tell. They will only share their side of the story. Here, if at all you feel that Anita, I got married, and this is my loving, caring husband. We share ten of course family. You have feelings for them. Okay, I can understand you have feelings for them. But what you are not understanding is, as of now, this person have some trust issues. The reason maybe why they have trust issues is because of your stubborn nature. Maybe you are like a child. You are not at matured emotionally, and this person may be completely in anxiety. Which is like you maybe even caused them to lose their stability. That is the reason why you are also now end up in the poverty. So financially you may be completely gone. And moreover, more than that, you are like I here. I'm not seeing what kind of mental breakdown you are giving to this person. You need to heal. You need to heal. Take some break and give some, this person some break. As I said just now, when my siblings fight with their husband, they will come to us, our home. Their husband will stay there. They will stay for two two days. I will solve the issue. What happened? You had asked this kid did something. I will shout on her. Then again, their husband will come. They both will go. So it is like giving some time to each other. Stay out of it. Take time for yourself. Give this person time for themselves. Okay. If you not giving the time continuously, you are putting like calling, doing something, shouting at them, you know, again and again messaging. Give a break. Take a break and give a break to other person. We are not a machines. We are human beings. We need to take time to process our emotions. No matter how mature you are, I am very well matured person emotionally, mentally, all the ways. Okay, but still, when I get irritated, <laughs> I, I deal with my divine counterpart. When I get it, I take time to process my emotions because it is new to me. I did not dealt with this husband kind of materials, so. This is very difficult for me. I never let anyone to come into my life. I am okay with as I am. <laughs> but it is someone have come in our life. It will take time to understand them, what they are, where they are coming from. At the same time, they will, for them also it will take time to understand what we are. Because I am a very strict person. But he broke all the walls. It, it took time for him also, it took time for me also. How did this person to break all the walls? It is like, it will take time. We need to be process, we need to take time for process that emotions instead of pushing that other person. You are doing that, don't do that. No way, no way. If at all you really feel that Anita, this is a loving, caring family, won't go anyway, it won't go. Why you are scared, what you are scared of? Just you are thinking that this person is going to leave you. And you will end up in the poverty. No, if at all you really feel this is a true love, when you when we are fighting, we will feel in that way. Even I, when I fight, I like my, I I'll tell my Krishna that no matter what happens, even though you tell me, I'm not going to entertain that idiot in my life. He's a fool. He won't understand. <laughs> but again, I'll accept him. <laughs> even I laugh at myself because when we are angry, when we are frustrated, irritated. It is natural because we are human beings. That's why I'm again and again telling we are not machines. We don't have this buttons like feel emotions. So you press the emotion button. Yeah, I'm emotional. Press the laughing button. Yeah, I'm laughing. No, we are humans, right? We need time to process that emotions. You time to yourself. You time to that person, whomever that person. You are giving mental pressure. Don't put mental. Pressure. Stop. At least after watching this reading, it won't go anywhere. If at all you feel this is loving, caring, family situation, it won't go anywhere. Okay? Don't worry about your love. If at all it is true, it won't go anywhere. No matter. You know, two and a half years, I gone through a lot. I dealt with different things. This is extra luggage for me. <laughs> I used to tell my Krishna, this is extra luggage you kept on me. I am, I am already dealing with a lot of things. Huh? You gave me extra luggage. But still, if it is true, it won't go anywhere. What we shared in 2022 is completely different what we are sharing now. 
I'm really became very patient with him, really understanding in a deeper way what exactly is what is happening, how what he is. He is also understanding me. In the past, whatever he used to do, he is not doing that. So we need to give time to ourselves as well as the other person instead of running behind them, chasing them. I can understand. Maybe you scared that you may be going to lose your stability. You may be going to lose your home. No one, no one become, no one will become homeless. So don't worry. Okay, this person won't go anywhere. Just give time. If at all you want to give time, even though it is a true love, this kind of situations, if you put lot of it, lot of burden or pressure, even though it is a true love, the true love will be killed. By whom? By you. Because you are not letting this person to feel the emotion. I hope you are understanding. Don't do that. Okay. Listen to your intuition. Listen to your intuition. The universe is there to help you. See, I am not saying that you are disconnected from the universe. No, the universe is there. God is there. Because see, you are, you, are, you are a beautiful couple. Problems will happen no matter how beautiful couple you are, how beautiful love you share, how deep emotional you share. Problems will happen. If at all it won't happen, you are going to board with your relationship. What is this? Every day same thing. <laughs> we need to fight. We should fight. That's how our relationship. So the more we, I'm not telling every day fight with them. But whenever you get fights with your partner, you will understand them better way. You will understand it more about them. That's how relationship will grow day by day. It is not that no, Anita. I want to know entire thing, everything now today itself. I told. I think uh, in last readings I said. When I used to get irritated, why you gave this? And you are telling that it is a true love. My Krishna said, it will take time. It is not the sweet you are preparing in 10 minutes. It is a love. It will take time. It will take sometimes lifetimes. Lifetime. To feel that love. Experience that love. It is not a Maggie that you are... Two minutes. Even Maggie also cannot cook in two minutes. They will tell that two minutes Maggie, two minutes my, my sister... Do she will take nearly five to ten minutes <laughs> at least to five minutes, not two minutes. He take a break, okay. At least after watching this, really take a break. Don't behave in a childish way, okay. So, what you should be careful about. See, the more you put push this person, this person is going to lose trust on you. So, this connection will lose the trust. And I always say, no matter what connection you are dealing with, trust is the main ingredient. And if at all you, I am not seeing that you have bad intention towards this person. No, you share love. That's where your, whatever love you carry for this person, it is scaring you that you may be going to lose that person. But this is not the right way to deal with the things. Okay, this is not the right way. It won't go anywhere. Okay, if at all it is true love, it is really a deep emotional bonding, it won't go anywhere. But in, you have that fear that maybe I'm going to lose that. I'm going to lose this beautiful ten of cups family. I'm going to end up in the poverty. That is the reason I don't want to leave it. I don't want to lose it. Because of that, you are destroying your own family. No one. There is no third party existed here. You are the one. Because you don't know how to control your own emotions. Because of your childish energy. You are destroying your own beautiful family. Because your partner already caught up with trust issues. They are not trusting you. Because you, every day you give mental tension, so who will trust you? What is this? Even I did not trust my partner so many times. You know, he sit with the evil people and he did, he participated in death magic on me. <laughs> and I told my Krishna, you are asking me to get married to this person. Now, who is sitting between the same people, who is doing death spells on me? Things will happen. It is not that he wants to kill me. He is helpless, powerless in front of that paper. So he need to sit. That's it. And today, whatever I do, because of you. Because I grab, he is in my energy. That is the reason how I came to know about entire things, whatever happening there. Okay. So here, you need to give time. Instead of feeling in this way, like, no, this person, now if at all, today I miss them, maybe never going to get them. No, it is love. Give other people to experience that love, feel that emotions. 
you need to feel take break no, no i'm not telling you need to go to the therapist deal just take a break but take a break don't worry about your connection you you won't go anywhere if at all you are worried about your shelter you have someone in your life who is like a father figure king of cups go towards that person they will give you shelter they will give you shelter okay and when you feel that feel this person like your father figure go to that person um, feel like your parental home take some time take some break once you feel at least you you yourself process your emotions then you will get the idea your intuition will guide you because universe is on you are not disconnected from the universe that is the reason why i am clearly explaining you you are not on the wrong path no you are not on the wrong path the only thing is you are childish because of your childish energy you are destroying your own family okay that's why i am explaining you clearly that don't no need to worry it won't go anywhere do you really think that love will someone will come and someone can come and kill the love no after we our death also love will be alive you some time okay take time for yourself you that person some time so that they will also calm down they won't go through this big mental breakdown if at all you are like no 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 i want i want it now means everyone want to be that strong with mind okay this person going through already mental breakdown you know it or not your partner is going through mental breakdown breakdown don't give lot of pressure to them so what you should be careful about see this is how most of the men will go for the second home third home fourth home because if they find peace at home they want to go anywhere if the home will become hell they will look peace in somewhere and we are like see how my husband is going towards other women and you will blame other women first we need to keep our home like a peaceful place so that when the men go out they deal with the world they when they reach home they should feel like that peaceful atmosphere you carry emotions i'm not telling you are not carrying any emotions but only thing is because of your immaturity childish energy stubborn nature and fear of losing that person maybe you never experienced this love from anyone so now you are like maybe i'm going to lose that love <laughs> okay having fear is good it is a sign that you have true love for someone but that fear should not kill your connection your true love okay remember that what you should be careful about see if at all you heal just to take a break things will come under your control because you are not just it is not just a ten of cups you go share two of cups but because of your tension because of your more than tension which is like you are like you are scared of ending up in the poverty so you scared of money losing the money because of that you are killing your own two of cups listen to your intuition universe is guiding you it is not that no one is i'm not getting any kind of guidance from the universe no guiding you the only thing is instead of listening to your intuition as simple as universe is telling you that see this person want to go anywhere as of now currently you should leave this person leave them but you are like no I don't want to leave this person because see, if at all I leave this person, I will end up in the poverty, or I will end up on the street. So I don't want to leave this person. No, universe is telling you, if at all you leave this person as of now, there is other person is there who can take care of you. King of Cups. Maybe it is your father figure or someone in your life who is like a father figure. You go towards this person. Okay, stay with that person for some time because anyway this. i am not seeing that you are completely disconnected you are listening once you take a break this break is needed once you take this break universe will guide you again what you should do what should be your next step okay so at least after watching this reading whatever you are doing that mistake don't do it because you are killing your own connection with because of your own uh, fear that you may be going to lose this person see connections are 
beautiful things and we should hold them very carefully which is like when it's, it is like a bird okay somewhere i read it relationships are like a bird uh, if you scared that ah oh, my i will i'm going to lose this bird this bird may be going to fly away so you try to hold it tightly you no need to kill you no need to worry about this bird will fly away it is going to die in your own hands because you are holding that bird tightly so it feels suffocation right it cannot breathe so it will die in your hands so you are going to lose your relationship if at all you are like okay anita this is a relationship no matter where i i wear that what i will do it is not going to go anywhere so if you lose if you feel free like you leave your hands it will fly away that is the reason we need to catch it like this okay we need to hold like this not like this not like this like this so that it will be there and it can breathe you are resting don't do it because you are own you yourself killing this beautiful two of cups this person feeling suffocated with your love lose lose your hands okay lose your hands don't go anywhere what you should be careful about what you should be careful about what you should be careful about you just listen to your intuition okay because i think you need to become independent or someone may be independent in your life or single what you should be, what you should be careful about you are putting lot of burdens on this person you are not understanding it you are killing your own connection <laughs> your person may be looking for sneak killing because you are killing that person you are suffocating that person see they are going towards the someone to have some sneak killing it is not that they don't love you or they hold love for someone it is just because you are suffocating them so they want to breathe so they are feeling that running away from uh, you will help them to breathe they are feeling lot of burdens on their shoulders with you they are going towards the past person if at all this person already dealt with someone past person they are going towards someone they may be going to take stand for themselves to go towards that past person maybe they they are seeing see this is a beauty other person they are seeing like they are single independent empress kind of person and they may be manifesting them but you are like no i want to be like a five of pentacle i want to be like a seven of man who want to stay who want to say this kind of woman no men want to stay with this kind of woman no i'm not telling you don't hold love actually you don't know how to deal with the relationships Okay? you don't know how to deal with the relationship just to give some break take some break give some break because wherever they are going it is a passion not love and they did not went they are just manifesting that person still they are in the manifestation process what you need to do is stop immediately stop putting pressure on you okay and take a break you take a break your intuition is going to guide you what to do next that's how you should follow approach this connection because it is a two of cups so you need to listen to your intuition it is anita i have love so what if at all you have love you are suffocating someone they will stay with you because you have true love they will run away from you who want to die in your hands no one want to die and you are telling them no anita i have love why i will die i will kill that person but you are not understanding you are suffocating them they are not unable to breathe should be very careful because they are going towards someone
This is how people will invite their third parties in their life. Hmm? Okay, so what you should be careful about? See, still things are in under your control. I am not saying that you lost the control. Okay, again I am telling. The only thing is you need to take a break instead of putting lot of pressure on this person and leave things for the universe. Okay, leave things for the universe. So universe will take care of it. How to deal with it? It will guide you. Okay, it will guide you. So what you what you should be careful about is about your two of cups. Don't run because maybe as of now you are still page. You have two of cups, but you need to give time, right? As I said, my connection started 2022. I don't even know that that time it is a two of cups connection. I really don't know. Now we are really in a two of cups connection. We both share great emotions for each other. See, love means wherever that person, we should pray, he, he should be safe, happy. That's it. it. It is not like, no, that person should stay with me. We should stay under the same, no, it is a love, right? Leave that person. Wherever they want to live, let them live. Let them be happy. It is a love. It is in a heart related thing. And if it is two of cups, give time to yourself. Your emotions emotionally will grow. Then you know how to understand your partner emotionally. And you both people will carry that 3D, like more than 3D, which is like a 5D telepathic connection. So you can connect with your partner. You no need to be in the same home. You no need to be call them for the 10 times, 100 times. Why oh, you are not lifting the call? Why oh, you are not taking my call? <laughs> Whom you are talking to? This is a beautiful connection you hold. Either you maybe don't know that you hold a beautiful connection. That is the reason you are worthy because you felt these emotions with this person. Maybe you never felt with anyone. I am seeing your energy is good. You carry that fear that, Anita, I never got this kind of partner. I am very happy with this partner. It is like a rainbow, colorful, happy life with this partner. But if at all you behave like this childish way, this partner will run away. Because they are already manifesting someone who is very single. And they, are, they want to make this person like their empress. Don't do that. Okay? You sometime because see you you kept lot of burdens. What happened? They became the mission. Now even though you listen to your, you are listening to your intuition, but they are not listening because they are in the four of ten of hands. Who kept ten of hands? You are the one. Who give the lot of burdens? You are the one. Don't do that. Give them some time. They will realize their own feelings, emotions. Give them time to realize their own emotions, own feelings. Let them connect with their in, intuition. When they connect with your intuition, they will come back to you. Don't kill your connection, okay? What is the suggestion for me? For me? For me? What is the suggestion for you? Justice is coming. Maybe it is for me also. <laughs> no, I never asked. But I got that. For me. So what is this justice is coming? See, someone is taking control of their life, either if at all you are the queen of advance, things are under your control, you no need to worry, you are simply, that's what I said, see, beautiful connection, but you are pressing it, why you are pressing it, it is not that you want to kill it, no, you scared that it is going to fly away, no, it won't go anywhere, but don't press it, as I said, hold it like this, see, like this, you need to hold this connection like this, not like this. It will you will going to kill the bird, and uh, not like this. Ah, okay, I love this person truly. That person also love me truly. So it won't go anywhere. Anita said it won't go anywhere. So I will be like this. no, don't. It is like not caring about that person, completely ignoring that person. And uh, that person will feel that this person don't have any kind of feelings, emotions, love for me. So they will fly. Don't do that. Okay, keep like this. Things are under your control. If at all you are the queen of hands, things are under your control. Because I am seeing you are completely intuitive. Completely you are listening to your intuition. You are not disconnected from the universe. Not disconnected from the intuition. Only this person, your partner disconnected from the intuition. Give time. 
if at all you put lot of effort lot of pressure this person will go through the mental breakdown they will say hey, i don't want to deal with you go get out of my life ten of swords if at all this person is my me f out of my life i don't want to deal with this kind of shitty things <laughs> i face my challenges with calm and strength okay this is a beautiful two of cups connection so you no need to worry it won't go anywhere it is a divinely guided unions even though someone try to come between you both breaks will come that breaks also to grow grow emotionally both the people if you give some break to this connection you will get some time for the relaxation you will grow emotionally your person whom ever not opening their heart chakra they will open their heart chakra but if at all you push like this you are going to kill your connection because i'm seeing the death card okay don't do that don't don't do that because with your own hands you are killing your connection no third party is there because you are pressing it your person unable to breathe it they want to go towards someone who is like in a not someone no matter who they are if at all single person is there if at all wife is every day in my organization i used to watch they used to sit for seven eight i'm not married so i used to sit and more or i used to go to the office 11 o'clock so i used to sit for 738 after completing all my work i used to, they used to sit 738 even though they don't have any work even though their team left i used to ask why you are sitting i came late so i'm sitting moreover i have work you don't have any work your department is already closed then why you are leaving <laughs> why you are not leaving and is i is better to sit with you than <laughs> going to my home <laughs> It is not that we have connection. It is simply they feel happy, uh, some kind of joyful, fun kind of atmosphere. If at all they go to home, their spouse is like again that our daily drama. No one want to stay there. At least <laughs> I I don't want to that kind of things. <laughs> so this is a beautiful connection. Won't go anywhere. As I said, follow that. Okay, justice is coming, which is like things are under your control. If at all you are the spouse, Queen of Wands. If at all you are the queen of wands, things are under your control. You no need to worry. This is a beautiful connection, and I am seeing you are listening to your intuition. You are on the divine path only. If at all you do messy things, God also cannot help. Okay. Thank you for watching. So, pile number three. Whom ever choose black tourmaline. So, what you need to, what you should be careful about, or whom you should be careful about. Okay. So, mean we we'll go and subscribe. If at all you are not subscribe, if at all you are already subscribe. Thank you for the subscription. Click the join button. Have a look at our YouTube store. Watch the ads. So, what you should be careful about? What you should be careful about? What you should be careful about? i think someone here going through some kind of depression you need to take control of your life you need to love yourself you may be worried about your finances but you are still uh, in the right place like at least at the, in the right place you are not on the street you know, things are under your control maybe you are just just some kind of worry maybe you are not getting the projects next future projects so you may be worried about it love yourself okay mm. Five of Cups. You may be sitting and crying about someone. If at all, Five of Cups is someone. You may be sitting and crying about that past person. You need to work on yourself. I am not saying someone complete energy is yours. You just need to work on yourself. It is like loving yourself. That's it. Just love yourself instead of uh, why? Why this sadness? What you lost that you are feeling sad? What is this Five of Cups? Because I am not seeing anything wrong. Things are still under your control. Still, you are wearing good clothes, sitting in the right, good place, and working. Maybe work is there still in your hands. You can at least you can work on yourself. You are in that position, situation. What is this five of cups? Is the same collective or someone else? Hmm. You are the one who is worry about the new projects. No, it won't go anywhere. Okay, calm down. Whoever watching, 
what is this known card because still things are under river control only secretly 10 of cups so you may be worried about the new beginnings because you're not you are worried that anita i'm i don't know whether i'm going to get some new projects or not i, I don't know whether i'm going to get some new work or not uh, maybe i'm going to lose my financial situation whatever it is still things are under your control just take time for yourself love yourself you may be have beautiful 10 of cups family instead of like what about the work what about the work no how we should work with the life if everything is going in our life fine in our professional and personal life then we will enjoy okay we need to give time to this time to this sometimes life is all about ups and downs right sometimes family situation may be good but in when it comes to work situation all the projects may be failing we are not getting new projects we are we are facing some kind of financial situations so we will get disturbed but that time maybe in family everything is fine so what we should do instead of focusing on this thing in our career finances we need to focus on our family we need to spend time with our family we need to go out with our family we need to have fun with our family it will be there it won't go anywhere your career will be there but whatever time see when you are busy running behind the money running behind the work you won't get time for your family now things are not working in your work situation right things are not going well as you planned so let it be let's give some time let's go to family let's enjoy with our family and have fun with our family you will have happy time happy moments because of this happy time happy moments your vibration will be different you will you will carry positive mindset you won't carry this sad pessimistic mindset okay if you even though you have beautiful 10 of cups family if you completely focus anita how good family happy family but as of now i'm worried about the finances as of now i'm worried about my career i'm not getting any kind of projects so i want to worry about it i'm completely feeling depressed pessimistic negativity you're not going to get anything moreover you're going to disturb your family life because you're going to bring this negativity sadness to your family beautiful family situation leave that leave that things we no need to work on everything same day we can give time it is not working the way you thought let it be give time to your family you need to work with your family okay so that your vibration will be very good you will be with positive mindset then you will get solution for your problem also and moreover if at all your positive mindset people when you meet people people will be like hey this person have we have some project let's offer that project to this person because this is a very positive person happy at least they see that positivity optimistic mindset this is a pessimistic mindset when you are feeling like pessimistic this person is already there, like them no don't give any project this person they are not in a good energy that's how we attract good things in our life okay one situation is i'm not seeing completely bad situation here see this is not completely bad this is not like this or at least like this things are still under your control you are not end up in the poverty still you are blessed still life is under your control only maybe next new projects you are worried about not getting new projects you will get it why you are worried go spend time with your family produce <laughs> kids if at all you have chance to produce the kids instead of focusing on that see in our pandemic no one went to the work what they did everyone is busy <laughs> that's how we are more now popular in the population we are the number one actually before pandemic china <laughs> we are in the second place now we are first place <laughs> that is our indian mindset right if something is not working let it be it is everything is fine here let's focus on this change your focus that's it what you need to be what you should be careful about what you should be careful about just change your focus okay see again i got you have beautiful family listen to your intuition listen to your intuition you have partner with whom you share the same kind of passion fire so go have fun have passion 
when you are worried about your finances. Because this worry not letting you to listen to your intuition. Understand? This worry not letting you to listen to your intuition. Because you are completely pessimistic, going towards the darkness, negative thinking, negative thoughts. If you change your focus, you will come into positive thoughts. Your mind will become positive. And you don't need to go somewhere to search for that positivity. You have family. Maybe you have someone in your life who is queen of cups. If at all, you are not the queen of cups. Someone may be queen of cups. Go towards that person. That is your family. You may be spouse. What you should be careful about. What you should be careful about. Maybe you are the emperor and you want to have some new beginning with someone who is like, not new beginning, maybe, I don't know, you are dealing with someone who is queen of swords, but uh, they are betrayed you, they betrayed you or they maybe don't want any kind of new weakness with you. I don't know who is this person now because it is completely different energy. You have queen of cups, why you are going towards the queen of swords or why you are dealing with the queen of swords, if at all you have four of wands with someone who is queen of swords. Uh, this is not emotional thing because this first row completely emotions. This second row is completely about the some kind of, if at all you have two families. One is ten of cups family. One is someone whom business, business with pleasure kind of person. But that person ended everything with you. They may have betrayed you. You are not understanding. They don't want any kind of new business with you. Listen to your intuition because you are worried about the finances. That is the reason even though you are getting messages, you are not listening to your intuition. You are getting, I am not seeing that you are completely disconnected. Universe is guiding you, but you are not listening. You don't want to follow because of worry. Yes, Anita, universe is guiding, but universe is not guiding towards the money. Universe is guiding towards the love. And I want money, Anita. Now I want money. You want, not need. Your situation is like I want money, not need money. What you should be careful about? You may be want equal give and take with this person, but you are going to get some kind of tower moment. Maybe you have some work situation, some family situation, okay? Uh, work situation, you are dealing with someone who is queen of swords. This person is already betrayed you. They don't want any kind of new weakness, but you are still expecting six of pentacles. Like, see, we are working together. We are business partners and we need to maintain equal give and take. But this person not maintaining because you know that this is ended. That's where you may be worried about the future. Anita, my business partner ended everything with me. Now I'm worried about my future. My I'm worried about my finances. Uh, so go towards your family. You have family situation with pin of cups, 10 of cups, pin of cups. Leave this person, leave this business partner. If at all it is a business partnership, you will find someone who, who, with whom you can partner up, with whom you can work. As of now, your focus should be on your family. Okay, instead of going towards the darkness, which is like a five of cups. Don't don't go into that depression. Go towards your family. Have family life. Go out with your partner. Spend some quality time with your partner. They will help you to change your energy. Right. What you should be careful about. Your partner may be going towards someone. If at all you have business partner, someone, that partner may be ready for the new beginnings with other person, not you. And you are seeing the truth. That may be created some tower movement. That is also one reason you are worried about your career finances. Because Anita, if at all my partner leaves, what I should do? Next what? about my finances no problem see in the entire world do you think that this is the only person and this is not not in, not even an empress this is just a two of ones why you are worried about this person leave this person if at all partnership is ending don't worry because you have beautiful family concentrate on that if you concentrate on that atmosphere like love emotions bondings good atmosphere you will listen to your intuition so your intuition will guide you towards the new opportunities. 
maybe you are going to get some tower moment because as of now you are worried your partner is going towards someone or they may be like ended a partnership they may be want to have partnership with someone else because this person betrayed this is a betrayal pure betrayal then now source you may be not expecting what is what you should be careful about what you should be careful about they may be looking for long term partnerships not this fiery kind of connections you should understand that maybe whomever that partner when they are partner up with you they may be just ready for the business with pleasure kind of at least just see you have ideas i have ideas let's come together work on our ideas so we both can build business so that's how you came now your business partner may be looking for something which is stable which is like long term partnership not like this um, just ideas business kind of thing they may be pentacles like a long stability kind of thing but you are not giving up on this person what you should be careful about just love yourself okay just give time to your family just fo- change your focus change your focus from this partnership whatever is ending whomever leaving you change your focus from this person and uh, whomever that family ten of cause family you have spend time with that person okay give some time to your family your things will come and un- it is already control i don't want to even say that it is not under your control it is under control so just scared of losing because of this ending the partnership what you should be careful about because i'm not seeing that you are on the street what you should be careful about you have two of cups this person is your two of cups beautiful partnership is there see you are worried about the money i can understand your situation everyone will face this in the natural eh? life in the life when it comes to emotional matters you are fulfilled satisfied you have beautiful ten of cups family beautiful partner with whom you share two of cups the only thing is now when it comes to professional related matter you may be have someone in your life who is like a partner with that person you are working you both are working together and that partner may be decided to get married with someone so they may be told that see i don't want to work with you now because i want to get married and i want to settle and at least they want to have something stable lifetime long term stable thing now you are worried that anita if at all this person leaves this partner goes what i should do so because of your worry you are going towards the darkness negative mindset not darkness negative mindset instead of doing that spend time with your family okay just to change your focus things are under your control what you should be careful about see maybe because of your attention you may be manifesting wrong things in your life don't do that okay just take a break take a break maybe you are manifesting someone because of your mental tension who is like a juggler you are manifesting juggler in your life just because of tension don't do that okay see things when things are not working professionally focus on career when things are not working personally focus on yeah focus on career when things are not working <laughs> career wise professional matters then focus on family give time to family that's all nothing you are not losing anything paint the sun back into your sky you are not losing anything you are just worried that fear maybe it is like um, maybe i'm going to lose this not 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 you are not losing anything i'm one with everything everyone and everyone your guidance is to remember we are all one and to treat each uh, each person animal and uh, sin uh, that is a problem i need to wear <laughs> reading glasses <laughs> so here just calm down okay i'm not saying anything wrong just take some break and that break also it is not like go home sleep no 
enjoy with your family you have beautiful family how beautiful time with your family with whomever you share this deep emotional bonding give time to that person you love to that person let that person to love you both shades called quality time so that you can come out of you no need to enter into this depression or sadness some kind of negative mindset or else everything is fine here you may be the queen of cups See, everything is fine. Everything is under your control. It is just a fear. That's it. Some justice. You are getting the justice. No need to worry. Just a partnership. You are going to get again. What is this pain? The sun back into your sky. Take action towards your person, whomever that family you share. Okay, because you may be simply sitting, not even caring about your family, not even calling your partner uh, because of your work tension, professional matters, you are not focusing on your partner. But you should understand your partner also. You are going through something, but your partner maybe don't know that. They may be worried about you, that why you are not calling, what happening with you. So you should call them, tell them that no need to call and tell all the stuff, whatever you are going through. They will take tension. Just go home. Enjoy with your family. Okay? That is the solution for your problem. Actually, there is nothing is there. If what you need to, what you should be careful about, this negative sign, mindset. Because you are, if at all you are in the negative mindset, you are going to lose your family bonding also. It is going to affect your beautiful family life. Okay? Thank you for watching.